We give you two choices. Sacrificing Shingo Tsukino to go after the Queen, or sacrificing the Queen and going to save Shingo Tsukino. Which one do you choose? Choose the one you prefer. Which poor little thing will be abandoned? Sailor Mercury, Sailor Mars, Sailor Jupiter, Sailor Venus. If you want to settle things with us, come to the Dark Castle. We'll be eagerly awaiting you, Sailor Senshi. Ah! <laughs> Shingo. What? What is this to store to space? Where did everybody else go? Somehow, we're all alone. On top of that, the space! It's definitely them. Come out, Abacito Senshi. You understood well. Well, since it's the second time you've seen this space, it's natural that you'd understand. Even if you seek help, no one will come to help you. You've been abandoned. It certainly wasn't that. You're using an illusion to delude me. How is it? Perhaps you really didn't wish for the fate that left you guys in the middle of battle in this way. Oh, that's right. Stop fighting us, because we'll prepare for you a splendid fate. Ah, father. And mother, too? What's the matter today? It's so rare that you two are together. Is that so? By the way, Ami, won't you eat with us today? You really should. Today is the anniversary of your wedding with that man. <laughs> right. That man. That wasn't very tactful. Father, it's okay. Let's go eat together. <laughs> of course. Mamoru-san. What's the matter? Suddenly fawning over me like that? Moreover, is it okay? Odongo Head has been looking for you today, too. She's okay, she's okay. Anyway, where should we go today? Where do you want to- Where do you want to go? Where? Hmm, Marmosan's room. There's nothing wrong with my room. It's okay. Well, I'm gonna prepare Marmosan's room. Yo, they're gonna bang! Senpai. What is it? Suddenly fawning like that. Anyway, is it okay? Today that girl was looking for you. Yeah, probably Usagi-chan. It's alright, I'll contact her later. But apart from that, Senpai. How was today's lunchbox? Ah, it was great today too. Even though you're so huge, you're very good at food. Whoa! Ah, you said I was huge again. Ha <laughs> ha I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But since I'm tall too, I like you. Senpai. Senpai. <laughs> hmm? Do I know you? Uh, my name is Minako Aino. Senpai, please read this. Well, later. <laughs> Hikaru-chan, I did it. I gave a love letter to Minami, Senpai. Did you get an answer? Uh, I forgot to ask him to give me an answer. Mina, what on earth were you thinking, really? So how was it? Now let's stop the fighting. It would be of no interest to you from then, from then on to continue the battle. What do you intend to do? Are you willing to destroy your own fate for the sake of Sailor Moon? That's right. Perhaps you did not become the Sailor Shinshi you wanted to be. So get back to your normal forms. If you do so, the destiny you wish for is waiting for you. The illusion you showed us is certainly the everyday life we wish for. But we've already made up our minds. We'll fight alongside with Sailor Moon. If Sailor Moon were there, we would probably have been very lonely. But now everyone is here. For the sake of our friends, for the sake of Sailor Moon, we'll fight. For how long will you keep saying this type of thing? You've rejected a great chance, how idiotic. Give up now and surrender. Humph. Those are certainly Sailor Senshi. Whoa, <laughs> I look forward to seeing you again in the Dark Castle. <laughs> and now you fall down. Hang on, everyone. What happened? Sailor Moon? You surprised me. Everyone suddenly just collapsed. The enemy attacked us. It seems we were left wide open. But no need to worry. That type of attack won't work on us. Yep, that's right. Of course. But... 
taking the Queen and Shingo as hostages. What a despicable trick to use. I can't abandon either. I'll help them both. Wait. Let's rescue the Queen first. The enemy doesn't want to face the Queen. On top of that, if it's in the Crystal Palace, the enemy probably won't be able to place traps. We also have to know what the enemy knows. Perhaps we'll also find their weakness. That's wrong. Shingo-kun's life is in danger. After we rescue Shing Blah. after we rescue Shingo-kun, it won't be too late to go help the Queen too. But not only do we not know if something happens to the Queen during that time, the enemy might just be hoping for time to attack the Crystal Palace. Damn! Using these dirty little tricks? Let's split up for the moment. It's the only thing left to do. Then, let's decide which way to go. I'll go rescue Shingo. Plus, if I don't go, my future self will be sorry. I'm going where Mama is. Everybody, what will you do? Since I want to settle things with Nurgle, I'll go with Sailor Moon. I think Mercury, Jupiter, and Venus feel the same way. Yes, me too. I have to settle a score with that girl, Marduk. For me, it's that crazy Ishtar. For me, it's Naboo. If we have to split, I don't care whose side I'm on. But I must choose one side. Indeed, I can't forgive either side. I will go with Small Lady. Me too. Well, we're actually going to split this up a little bit. We're going to like we're going to we're going to have a trade. A trade has been announced between Sailor and she. Uh, Pluto is being traded to the Moon Team for Sailor Venus. That way we can have we don't split up like the powers of of Pluto and Saturn, or we don't have them specifically just on one team and have one team like overpowered compared to the other. That way it's a little more even. Everyone, say hello to the Queen for me. Chibi Moon, be careful, don't blunder. Sailor Moon, you too. Yep, well, we're off. We definitely won't lose. Take care, Sailor Moon. What shall we do? I'm following Chibi Moon. Then I'll go with Sailor Moon. When our respective goal is attained, let's wait for each other at the gates of time. Take care, Artemis. Sure, you too. The Sailor Shinshi are coming this way. But first, I must change my fate. If I don't, my life will be gone by morning. Perhaps. But if I can change my fate, I can become the successor of the Mystic Silver Crystal. The power of the crystal and the power to change fate. Holding those two powers, I can be an eternal queen. Apsusama. It seems the Sailor Senshi are splitting into two factions. I don't care. If the Sailor Senshi don't intrude upon my ceremony, it's fine. Just buy me some time. Understood. The ceremony will be conducted at the Tower of Time. Fiori is fighting with Tuxedo Mask on the middle floor at the moment. Tell Onshar to leave open a direct path to the Tower of Time. Yes. Very soon. The world you desire is coming very soon. A world where you and your brother can live together in peace and quiet. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hurry! Bring the Mystic Silver Crystal to me quick! Ha! Ha! Alright. Do you wish to save? Yep. Let's, uh, let's, let's formation up here for a sec. Do that. Jupes is in the middle, or is in the top up here. Uh, Mercury, Mars, Pluto. Okay. That's all well and good. And then we'll double save. Just in case. So we have to level pretty much everyone up to 45 before we are... Before we're good to go. Which is gonna be a pain in the butt. Kind of. Uh. Shingo, stay safe. I'll save you. So we gotta go to the castle. And then we can do some battling. Duh! Well, <laughs> Mars is dead. <laughs> I 
Might just have to have her defend. For the time being. She's got 628 HP and she got fucking, like, one-shotted? Fucking hell. Guess you're defending. <laughs> well, I don't want to go there yet. I need to. There's a merchant boy in here somewhere that I need to find. Snow Kagia. Mercury leveled up. Moon leveled up. Mars leveled up. There you are. I'm a traveling merchant. Would you like to buy something? Yo, you got any... Uh, I got some bentos. Sweet. I'll take that. Let me get some fragrances. That would be... Hella good. It's gonna roam around here. And, uh, we'll do some grinding for a bit, and then before we have to call it, Combatter A! I might as well just, like, put on, like, multiples, just on the... In case. In case we have to... Uh, go against any of like, those types of enemies. Alright, so, the closest we have to 45 is Jupes, who's 41. And then next is Pluto, then Mar- then Moon, then... Mercury and Mars, so... Look at those fast battles. Fast battles! <laughs> also, we could just do this. Super grinding. Also, why is the merchant boy just like <laughs> fucking spazzing out? It's the quickest way to get to 45, obviously. All right, let's see where we're at now. Uh, 41, 40, 39, 43, 42. <laughs> Told you it's fucking fast. <laughs> this is the power of emulation for you. Which also makes me sad that you can never do this in like other games. Like, like see how much faster grinding would be. I know they have like those uh those Final Fantasy re-releases that they've been putting out, like seven, eight, nine have that type of stuff in it where it's like there's a three XP that you can use. Which is super useful. Alright, let's check our, our stats here. 45, 44, 46, 45. So let's do this a little bit more, and then we'll be good to go. Super grinding, fast grinding, it's super fast. I like how there's an enemy called Doorknob. Alright, what are we at now? 46, 45, 47, 47. Let's get them up like a little bit more. Just like past 46 or 45. Just to be safe. 